Hey everyone, so I'm going to show you guys how I went from having this wavy hair with the crinkles in it to absolutely straight with no waviness whatsoever in just a matter of minutes. So I was gifted this hair straightener brush by a company called Saipu and I'm just showing you what the packaging looks like right here. I'm going to go ahead and do an unboxing and show you what comes inside, has a comb, the instructions and also a thank you card and of course the product itself. I love the pink on there and this is what it looks like up close. The power, the up and down button, it has a 360 cord so it won't get tangled and I love the length of the cord and also comes with a little strap so that when you're done you can wrap it back up. This is what it looks like when you plug it in. I'm going to hit the power button and turn it on. Um, the plus button will increase it and the minus button will decrease the temperature. So it does come in Celsius but I'm not familiar with Celsius, so I did have to refer to the packet right here. It does show you what the Fahrenheit is, or you can just look it up on Google. So that's not too big of a deal. But now I'm going to go ahead and get started on my hair. Um, one thing that I do like about it is that it only gets hot in between the little grooves. So if you accidentally touch the product on the outside or at the top anywhere, you don't have to worry about getting burnt because it only gets hot down inside of the grooves. So... This is my first time using the product right here, so I was trying to find the best way to use it that would get my hair straight the quickest. And I think one of the things that I like to do that worked the best was going in from the bottom. Going in from the top worked pretty good too, but it seemed like I could get a better hold on it whenever I would go from the bottom instead of from the top. But I also made sure to get the top and the bottom just to make sure that I got my hair as sleek as possible. So what I did, I did sleep in a few braids because I had already flat on my hair for the week. But I wanted to show you guys how this product works. If your hair maybe is wavy or curly or even frizzy, I just wanted to show you that you can just simply brush it out to get straight results. So if you don't like using a flat iron or you don't know how to use one, or anything like that, this is definitely a simple solution. Just use the brush and brush through your hair. Now, one thing that I do wish I would have done differently is take smaller sections because my hair is so thick that I feel like I actually could have got it straighter than what I did. But I kind of tried to take big chunks to get done quicker. But I really do feel like if I would have took even smaller sections, I could have got my hair like super, super straight. But even for taking the bigger sections that I did, the product still worked really well. So that's what I did like about this product. Another thing is that after 20 minutes, it will shut down. So if you accidentally forget this and leave it plugged in, you don't have to worry about that because it's going to automatically shut off for you. It does have seven heat temperatures. It goes up from 248 Fahrenheit to 392 Fahrenheit. But like I stated earlier, this product is in Celsius, but it's easy to um, just look at the directions and see what the Fahrenheit is. Also, I love that it does have a temperature display on there instead of just a knob, how some products will have like an up and down button or something like that. This actually has a LED screen so you can see exactly what temperature that your hair is on. I started at a higher temperature earlier in the video, but I did end up turning it down because the product gets pretty hot and I usually use heat around 340 to 380 on my hair. One more thing that I do want to mention is that I will be having a giveaway of this product. All you need to do is like this video, leave a comment down below, and also email me at my email address that you'd like to enter and leave your screen name in the email as well. I will be notifying the winner via email and I'll also leave the winner name down in the description box a week from now. So from here, I'm going to let you guys continue to enjoy the video. Make sure to give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. And if you guys have any questions or comments, just let me know.